most beautiful time of the year I just feel the streets spreading so much cheer I should be playing in the winter snow But I'ma be under the mistletoe Hey guys, welcome back to our channel and if you're new, welcome. My name is Aisa and I'm really glad you clicked on this video. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to achieve this red holiday makeup look. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to see how I achieve this look, definitely stay tuned. But before we get into this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. And of course, stay tuned and watch our other videos at the end of this video. If you want to see more hair videos, makeup videos, fashion videos, and lifestyle videos. But yeah, I'm going to stop rambling and let's get right into this video. Okay guys, so I'm starting off with my face fully done and that's just because I had other things to do earlier in the day and obviously I went out so my face is already basically done. I already have a full face but you know we're gonna focus on the eyeshadow for this look so I'm going to be doing this time a red Christmas or holiday inspired makeup look so I hope you guys like it. The first thing I'm going to do is go into my Kamaya palette and this is from Sugar Bee Cosmetics. It's black owned and I really really like their palettes like I use them in a lot of my looks like if you follow me on Instagram you know that I use them in a lot of my looks. So I'm gonna go in this first shade right here and it's called Perfect You and I'm just going to use that as a transition color. But before doing that, I'm going to go ahead and use my CoverGirl Undercover Concealer and just prime my lids, obviously. Okay, so now that my eyes are primed, I'm going in that shade like I told you guys. And just putting that right above my crease and that's going to act as a transition color. Okay, so now that I'm done with that transition shade, I'm going to go ahead and use this shade over here. And that is called Coral Sands. And I'm just going to put that right underneath that crease and it's just going to kind of all blend together. Well, actually, I'm putting this right in my crease, basically, underneath that color. So as you can see after I kind of blended that in my crease, I also blended it in my inner corner and that's basically how I want it because I don't want it to be too coral, I want it to be more red. So next I'm going to go into my duo palette and this is by Nikak New York. It's actually a blush, I always use it as my blush. But I'm going to use this color because it's kind of like a red and I want to use this mostly just to make it make this look more red. I want it to come out more red because obviously it's the holidays, duh. Okay, so this is what my eyes look like. I feel like they're kind of like an orangey red, which I was going more for like a deeper red, but this also kind of, it still looks good, you know? It's still really close to red, so it's still like holiday appropriate. So next I'm going to go into the Masaya palette by Sugar Bee Cosmetics and we're doing something out of the, like kind of just give it a pop of color. So I'm going to go into this golden shade and this shade is called Gold Crown. So we're going to put that mostly on the inner eye. 
and yeah I just feel like it's gonna make this look a little different you know first I'm going to use my concealer just because I want to define my crease so that's what I'm gonna do and I'm going to use that brush that same brush I used okay so now that I'm done defining that area I'm going to take that gold shade like I told you guys. Now, because it's kind of like a glittery shade, I'm going to go ahead and put my brush underneath just because I don't want it to get like on my face. Look at how that shade is just like so beautiful guys like I forgot how beautiful this gold is because I haven't used it in a while Okay, so that's basically how it looks and I did that because that was a glitter shade It's not like a normal shimmer, you know, it actually has like little chunks it's kind of like a pressed glitter they have a few in these palettes so that's why i basically put my brush under but you don't have to do it if it's just a shimmery shade that's why normally i don't do this okay so now to give it a pop i'm gonna go ahead in that white shade and put that in my inner tear duct just you see how it just like opened up my eyes brought the look together like i like that and that shade is called angel eyes guys i, I think i forgot to mention it but yeah i just feel like it just made the look like psh, pop even more so i really really like that shade so next i'm gonna go ahead and pop on some lashes and the lashes i'll be using are from bd by lashes i do have a discount code if you guys want to check them out and it's aisa 15 i will put it in the description box for you guys but basically these are in the style quartz and i haven't used them in a while like but i really really like these lashes so i think it's just going to bring the look together perfectly So guys, this is how it looks with the lashes on. Basically, I feel like these lashes definitely complete the look like I love it. But anyways, moving on to the lips, I already have my signature combo lip and that is my Anastasia Beverly Hills contour cream kit to line my lips and my Sugar Bee Cosmetics lipstick in CEO. So I think I want to add a little like, I don't know, a little something to the lips. So I haven't used it in a while, but I'm going to use this lip gloss by Prissy by Princess. It's basically like this, I want to say like metallic-y shade and it's perfect over nude lipsticks. And I feel like for the holidays, it just like brings a little something to the look. So I'm going to add that. It's a lip gloss. So it's gonna make my lips also a little more like glossy and it smells so good. Oh my god, I forgot how good it smells. You see how it just made my lips like shine? I don't know, I, I like that. I miss like, it's been a while since I've used this, but I forgot how like good it was. No, my lips are a little dry guys, but you know, it still looks really good. So this is basically like what the look looks like. So guys, this is the end of the video. It was a quick little eyeshadow tutorial on this look and I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys will wear it during the holidays. So if this video was helpful, definitely give it a like and comment down below what other videos you would like to see, whatever it is, any other videos you would like to see, definitely comment them down below. I would like to, you know, know whatever you would like to see and of course I'd like to give that to you guys. So thank 
thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, because you definitely need to subscribe and join the family. But yeah, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys!